on guys it's a bourbon angle and i'm back out here doing some more fishing for you guys and today as the titles and thumbnails suggest i was out there with eric on his boat doing some fishing on lake geneva so for anybody who's not a local viewer anybody who's not familiar with lake geneva it's just one of those inland lakes out in wisconsin loaded with all types of species walleye smallmouth largemouth pike muskie you know the whole nine yards and this particular day we were just out there targeting smallmouth doing a little bit of finesse fishing threw a little bit of power fishing so you know a little bit of chatter base a little bit of top water didn't really catch too much on that but we were slaying them on some drop shots a little bit of tightrope jig and for anybody who's not familiar with tightrope jigs well they're a local company based around the chicago area they recently started collabing with catch co and they make some really good micro jigs they make the baby firework jig and the firework jig and they've been recently fe featured in a lot of the bigger youtuber videos anyways that's what we were using that's what we were slaying fish on and there's really nothing much else for me to say. I just want to get you guys straight to the beat down. So without further ado, sit back, relax, and enjoy. Yep. Ate it on the fall. It's nice. So Bird, turn it up. He's turning it up on him. Yes, sir. Right after I started a new clip, guys, we got to... Uh, probably. It's kind of decent. Oh, um, oh, oh, oh. It's giving me a little tussle. We got the club going up. Here, go on this side of your left of you. Yep. That's a nicer one, yeah. Small mouth. No, oh, no, a big, large mouth. Yeah. Man, we're ready, dude. Oh my god, I get these. Fucking... Good way to start Good us off. Drop shot. Mm -hmm. On the robo worm. He's got the club going up on a Tuesday. <laughs> on that little owner hook mosquito. What you call it? Better stop him up. Got him unhooked for you folks. For the folks. For the kiddos back home. You can get a good release. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Two and a quarter pound, a little 16 inch bass. Let's get him back chilling in the depths. Come on. Oh. Oh. He hit it hard too. It was a like, boom. It was like the type of bite where you're like, for sure, that was the best. It's a bass, bass. He was being finicky. Okay. It might be a small the way it's head shaking. It's probably like a huge rock bass. No, it's a large mouth. Nice large. Little guy. Yeah. I knew it was a f bass that hit it. Right in his. Oh! I couldn't. Ah! He's like, eh! Right in the top of. Right in the top of his nose, guys. Colors. Yep. Yeah. Healthy little dude throwing back. I knew it was a bass. It was too hard of a thump. Yeah. He hit it. He hit it, and then he kind of just slid back on it and slowly sucked it in. And I just like lifted on him real, really slow. Clinic, For real, the LMBs don't know what happened to him. I knew that was a fish, though. I was like, I, I was like, is that a bite or is that just me being slow? And then he took my robo worm. That fish is gonna come back on this cast. Watch. Told you he was coming back. He ate it. He ate it. He ate it aggressive. It's bigger, dude. Look at him. He's ripping some drag, or he's just an aggressive little. Oh, I don't know. I can't tell. I think it's a freaking. Yeah, it's a big largemouth. Oh yeah. It's it's nicer. It's like a three. And that is what we need tomorrow. Oh yeah. They're gonna be here. Look, he took my 
worm again. Get the same kind of, you want a picture? Oh yeah, I'll get one. You get, you get a little, you get a little one. A little some some. You got the camera on your head. He was fighting hard though, I thought he was like a four. Yeah. Alright guys, really well built largemouth. There's a lot of fish hanging off these weeds. 20 foot with like 3 foot of weeds coming off the bottom. We're chilling, catching fish. More dream shots and stuff with me too, but it's alright. Forgot him, you were going pop smoke. <laughs> I was too turned up. Of what Eric is on. Net or no? The, another okay, Whitaker tightrope jig. Yes, look. sir. For the yes, boys, tightrope jig. I'll screenshot that. The mouth. It's a pretty large mouth. Mm -hmm. We're on them offshore largemouth guys, on like a 20 foot flat. Smacking on them. Oh yeah, that's sick. Like a big, a lot of guys sort of football do like punching football. I've never seen them on it, but I was like, I saw this heavier tire on I'm like, yeah, that's what I need to see. Mm -hmm. And it's killing it. It's got the the way it, the head is structured. You know, the line ties at the top. Yeah, I know. I love it. It it, it has like it's very it, it runs very true. Like it hops very good. And I love the weed guard too. It works, but it's not too thick. Yeah, so right now, guys, I'm just throwing the drop. You can literally stuff you could buy at Walmart. Some Robo Worms, some Eagle Claw drop shot weights. They're like 316th ounce. Oh, I might have one right now. Yeah, I think so. Okay. Okay, dude. Is that a rocker? Or no, is that a large it's a large mouth. Oh my god. He's coming. Okay. Smack so like I was saying guys, stuff you could get at Walmart and we're smacking some LMBs. One of the most pressured lakes in our area too. Oh, come here bud. Why did I grab them so far away? <laughs> Slipped right out once you got the pliers. That's why it's always essential to have those. All right, guys, another two pound LMB. If we were fishing a tournament today, okay, we're doubled. What is that? Oh, it's just a, a fast, a very fast. Ooh, that's a good one, dude. They meant us both flipped a three on the quicks. Dude, tight rope, tight rope jigs, dude. That's you sure. Gotta have one. Look Go at that. get one. Yeah, go get one. We're giving that promotion. We're slaying right now. Get that double tank kit, bro. Yeah, this. As soon as I started casting to this side of the boat, we literally caught fish like every yeah. cast. We're on the outside of it a little bit more. Dude. That's a nice one he got right there. Dude, we're yeah. slaying. Let's get Dude. that. Let's get that double underwater release. Yeah. Oh shoot! You got the ah. Uh, here, go down. Oh yeah. Er, go down on yeah. the other side. Yeah, back to the boat. Why can't I talk? <laughs> Let me make sure. That's a nicer one too. All right, ready? Yeah, it is stacked right here, guys. All right, guys, the audio is probably going to be crappy for like the next three minutes while the water gets out of the mic, but trust me, that release, the release is always going to be worth it in these clear lakes. Oh, we're railing out here today. Yes, sir. That hook set up, the jig's like, thunk, and I'm yeah. like, yo. <laughs> yeah, we're slaying. I think there's, there's, there is definitely a bunch I love of. Fishing, I love fishing. <laughs> for real, that's why we come out here, guys. But now, let me finish what I was talking about. So like I said, stuff you can get from Walmart, 3 16th ounce drop shot weights, some robo worms, like purple, pink, any color will really work. I'm just using these because these are my favorite color. They've always, had, always have been. And the last thing is probably the most important thing is the hook. You can't just be using any crappy old hook. You got to get something good. Obviously, I mean, it's just a hook. A lot of brands make really great drop shot hooks. Right now, I'm just using owner mosquito hooks, but you could use anything that you trust in that you know is quality anything that you know an experienced guy tells you to use just don't be using some 99 cent clearance dick specials drop shot hook with a long shank too yeah definitely 
don't get him in the skin, you get him in the bone. You notice know though? That's why I throw the Nikos. Mm -hmm. like yeah, no, this hook has like a nice little medium sized shank. It's been it's been good. Yeah, these these have been all no doubters. I might have one right now. Yeah, he's swimming with it. <laughs> Every cast. <laughs> yeah. Turn the Oh, he's, he's pulling some Turn up. Dude. Dude. I'm oh. fired, dude. We could fish Robbie's tournament out here, dude. Ooh. Okay, okay. Oh, my God. Turn up. Might be a small way to do the baits here for a smallmouth to be here. I got net. That's a good fish. Big smallmouth, I think. Nice smallmouth, I think. Oh, I gotta get it there. No, you're good. No, nice largey. Keep him down, keep him down. Oh, he's good. That's a three and a half. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. That guy's like, calm down. All right, I'm gonna get the fish over on this side of the boat, guys. This is a freaking damn... That's a good one, yeah. It's close to four. Yeah, I was about to say. I think it's... scale? Yeah, I do. That's that's close to four. Get a scale on it. Oh my god, dude, we're lit. <laughs> we're lit right now. We are lit right now. We are turnt right now. That is a Yo, toad. Oh, that is dude, a toad. I fucking love this. <laughs> <laughs> now bite tomorrow. For real, right? These guys we're better be busting tomorrow. Him. We're beating up on them. So bro. right now, we're slapping. Nice. <laughs> Let's go. I love bass fishing. That's a toad. Another one here. Another double up selfie. Yeah, dude, this one was ripping drag, guys. I mean, you guys, you guys watched the fight. That Can't thing. Beat that on the drop shot. That's, that's a nice beast right there. It's almost, probably close to four. It's probably like 3.6, 3.7. Get out there. Be here tomorrow, please. All right. Please be here tomorrow. Honestly, when it ripped drag for a second, I thought it was a pike. Dude, it's been okay. So me and be dude, tomorrow, we've been casting to this side of the boat. I know, right? Dude, we're slapping on them. Again. That's the nice thing about when you get on a good bite or when you're like recording is you people think YouTube is like not not everyone thinks this but sometimes people think YouTube videos are like complicated or hard or blah 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 like you like it, but like I literally only have 88 minutes of space on this SD card and like 50 on the other SD card that I brought. So let's say I catch like two more fish, you catch two more fish, and then that's all we catch with the space that I have. Like that'll be a video right there. Like I'll be able to like literally make a Lake Geneva video with like a with like a 12. Ooh, on the fall, dude. I literally was just oh oh dude, this is nice. Yeah, dude, it just peel drag on me. He's coming up. He's long. I, that, that, that jump made him look deceivingly small. Dude, my line just was like flying, dude. Don't mess up your line. Make sure you check your meter. Yeah. Nice job. Nice little green back, bro. Bro. So like I was as I was talking about yeah this could be a dope video for you guys literally I'm like my line was like dude like he was flying with it like he ate it before it even hit the bottom like he probably came ten feet yeah. off the bottom to eat it look at how like look at how pristine they look though look at can you turn them towards ah oh, damn they're so beautiful that boy young look at how pretty they that look. man is a he's a young gentleman <laughs> <laughs> yeah guys literally <laughs> like on the fall this, my line was getting so tight like jeez. We're on him. The way he ate, the school probably just came back through. Or maybe they just got fired up on that yeah. drop. Get him, son. Got one. Girl. It's coming. Right up. Oh, like, no, let me go down. It's a nice one, dude. That's not right. it's dude, it's decent. It's the I'm trying to. Dude, I'm trying to tell you, bro. I I saw I saw a flash. That's 
that's behind you. It's a three. It's a three. Told you, bro. That boy is bigger than he looked. <laughs> that boy is bigger. That boy bleeding. Here, grab the net. Grab the net. That fish. That was a good. That was one of those eats where he. I just felt him go boop, eat it, and then he didn't even swim off. He just kind of chilled. Another three pounder. A little three point two. Our bag just increased from 12.5 to 13 right there. That guy has a gut. Yeah, they're starting to get their build back. He has a gut. These fish pre-spawn are like freaking... Toss him back. Yeah, that was a cool eat. He just kind of thunked it and then just sat there and I lifted slowly and I was just like, yeah. On. Yeah. You like that? It's a cool one. Good one. Power fishing. On the yo yo technique. You can't slack on power fishing in clear water. Thank you. You like that? For I yo-yoed it hard, and then I he he ate it on the fall, and then I lifted back up into it. He was just on. Some nice two-pound bass right there. Okay, bud. <laughs>